Jin Young Ko. A winner already this year. This is the ninth after eight straight pars. Yeah, she's had, as any player does in this game, has a bit of a, has had a bit of a struggle, but nice to see her playing well here so far this week. Jin Young second at 10. They got lucky, got it all the way through the tree. Fortunate, off the tee. She needed an eagle to tie the lead at the Chevron Championship. 11. Jin Young Ko is second. That from 122. Oh, dialed in. How good is that? Most. She made some good, good putts. This is a short birdie putt for Jin Young Ko, not a problem. Pretty accessible hole location today. Trying to cut back towards the flagstick. That's a good smart play. Middle of the green here in the 12th. On most greens on an old style golf course is never a bad idea. Just a little tentative maybe? Wow, that got all the way to the hole. Yeah. How quick. Didn't look like it, did it? No. Easy birdie. Well, Jim referenced the wrist injury. Really began to bother her. Starting about this time last year, she did finish top 10. Tom, that's not a hole for the stinger, is it? You want to take that too low off the tee. I would guess that during the year, the bush around the tee might might get hit a couple of times. We'll, we'll double check it here as we go to 13. And the second for Jin Young Ko. 129, just a soft nine iron. Flag on that little shelf on the left. It's okay. And go back on that line. Junior Ko for a birdie. He's to edge out in front by one. This is looking a lot like the Jin Young Ko that we're used to seeing, isn't it? Oh, she's just not making any mistakes. Just want to keep it right at her or just right of the hole. She loves to lay up to 75 or 90 yards, typically. Is there a lot of bent in this grass? It's just beautiful. Yeah, 151, just a probably a smooth eight iron four, a little right to left win. shot there yeah if you miss the fairway it's gonna to be tough to hit the green that's for sure getting a bit windy it's Jin Young lets it rip at 16 uh, and that is premier wow. there beautiful Minji and Jin Young have a way of making the game look easy when they're playing at their best Exhale. Oh, and both driving the ball in iron is play, play as well. And starts out to the right, a little better line than Ponta Oka's. Yeah, needs to just sit down. Might come back now. Yeah, and she's going to have a nice look at Birdie. Mentioned that wrist injury. It wandered slightly offline. So it's going to be a three. On the tee at the short 18th, Jin Young Ko, who's now going to be tied for the lead. Yeah, just laying up a little bit of helping win. That's up on the right side. Might need a kick to the left. Oh, now see, that's what happens. Yeah, I think a lot of times, a lot of these lefts, you get over the false front, they're flat, so it takes that first big bounce. There's the first bounce, and well, it's going ball. to be another great chance. Not many bogey free rounds around Upper Montclair. She's got one going. She's only had one bogey all week. All right, so Jin Young Ko with a round of 68.